Hey, what is wrong with you? Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, she's out of frame. She's out of frame. That's just great. And poof. <gasps> oh my God, she's back. This, you have no idea. <laughs> We need to focus today, okay? Because I've been saying that I'm gonna bring my ghost sims back to life for like literally months and it keeps not happening. In my defense, it is very difficult to get all of the ingredients to make ambrosia. Like it's been months and I still only have one angelfish and one death flower, but I need two of each. And at this point I am giving up, okay? I'm just gonna cheat and give myself a second of each because I have two ghosts and I can't just like bring one back to life and not the other. You know, if this one hadn't just gone and died randomly in a fire, we wouldn't have this problem. But alas, here we are. Welcome back to the Nightmare Legacy Challenge, by the way. It's good to see you. As far as other plans today go, it is almost Bo's birthday. Oh my god, and the dog is old! No! Oh, I didn't even notice the dog aging up. I was looking at this notification. Okay, well, dog has passed her peak and has become an elderly dog, so that's a bad sign. We've got about two days left now with the old dog. Short lifespan makes things happen very quickly, so I'm not joking, by the way. At this rate, that means dog is on her way out. But anyway, Bo is almost a teen, and Blue is also almost a young adult just three days until they age up and that is really concerning because I'm gonna need to build a new house soon and I kind of forgot about that. One step at a time though, everyone's just gonna go back to bed, we're gonna have a nice relaxing night because we've got a big morning tomorrow, everyone's gonna come back to life. I just had you shower and now you're bathing too, are you joking? You know what Anna, you've been causing me a lot of problems recently. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say it but you've been causing me a lot of issues. There we go, Pepper is back from work, you can go to sleep too. So to bring these ghosts back to life, we're gonna need a few things. We have to create the ambrosia. Each ghost needs their own ambrosia to eat. And to craft that ambrosia, there's a few things required. So number one, we need to have the max gourmet cooking skill. Luckily, our chef Sim Pepper has had that for a very long time. We're ready. You need to have an angelfish, a potion of youth, and a death flower. That's where we have our problems because I only have like one angelfish. And now that I look at it, it seems that I have none death flowers. I think that I foolishly decided to plant the only death flower that I have and it hasn't regrown anything. Oh, there we go. We have one. Okay, good. <laughs> we have one death flower. See, I got it from this spliced plant, but it hasn't like grown me extra in a while. So, um, I don't want to wait anymore. To fix this problem, I'm gonna go on the gallery and I'm just gonna search up death flower and I'm gonna hope that someone has uploaded one and just steal it. So, fingers crossed. There we go. We've got some plants of them too. I could get extra. Is that like too cheaty? Oh, this one has ambro- Never mind. I shouldn't just like get the ambrosia plates off the gallery. That's bad. This one has just two from Lil43278. That will do. Thank you very much. Okay, well, if I can find a place to put it. Those are also like super sized up for some reason. I'll just take that. Thank you. I'm also going to need an angelfish. Okay, this one should be easy. Thank you, Riki Teak, on the gallery. I will be stealing that as well. <laughs> you don't understand. I spent days fishing days and all we got was one. Um, actually, I just spent all day today fishing and I got that one the perfect right way. I didn't cheat for that at all. I, I found it fair and square. I didn't just get it off the gallery. What are you talking about? Okay, luckily everyone's got the day off today. <laughs> Which is good, because it'd be a real shame if Anna had to go to work after she came back to life. Should I, like, clean up the house first, too? I feel like I need to get ready for this. If I'm gonna spend all this time trying to bring these ghosts back, I feel like I need to have the house, like, in pristine condition. Blue, come fix this. Oh, okay. Disappeared, came back. Honestly, Blue needs to work on their, like, handiness skills and stuff anyway. If you're gonna be the heir, you need to be a little bit better. I don't think you have, like, any skills yet. Oh, yeah, you suck. Oh, no. Yeah, you need to, <laughs> you need to get a move on. I'm not gonna bother cleaning up the fire toilet. That's just not gonna make a difference. It's gonna just come right back. Oh my god, the house really is a mess. Look at this. There's plates everywhere and like dirt on the floor. I think the dog is sick. Oh my god. Do I have any like- I know I've got vet treats. Oh, I've got some fancy stuff in my inventory. Did I run out? Tell me I didn't run out of vet treats. I don't want to have to go back. Oh no, we're fine. Okay, <laughs> I've got a wellness treat. We're good. We're good. False alarm. Don't worry. What are you doing? Why aren't you giving the dog the treat? I forgot about school. Okay, um, you can go alone. Sorry. <laughs> got other plans today. I've got like quite magical plans today. In fact, I intend to bring your grandparents back to life. There we go. The dog is fixed. Okay. Is the house ready? The house looks ready. Okay. Okay. Now it is time to craft the stupid ambrosia. After all of this, after everything we've been through, after Anna burned in a fire by accident, after Blake went and died of old age, we finally, finally get to bring these sims back to life. It's been so long. Okay. Everyone watch this very carefully. If you mess this up, Pepper, I'm sorry to say, but I will never forgive you. Like do not start a fire in the process. 
this. I don't think you can. I think that our fridge is too expensive. I think it doesn't catch on fire. Um, but I wouldn't be surprised if it did. It feels like stuff like that just happens to me in this safe. Okay. Oh my god. I'm trying to get a screenshot, but I keep getting in the wrong walls. <laughs> okay, that is a horrible screenshot. Like, absolutely horrible screenshot. But that's fine. <gasps> did you just grab that? Oh my god, I'm sorry. I thought she almost ate it. I was about to cry. I was like, you can't do that. You can't touch this. Okay, I'm gonna set it down right here. Anna, you get to go first because you had to die first. I feel like I need to have something more ceremonial for this, but there's just not gonna be. What are you doing? Emotional meltdown. Are you are you serious? Okay, so I can't cancel that. I have to wait until it ends. Um, Anna's having an emotional meltdown. I think Blake is haunting my mirror. Okay, we're done. We're ready. Okay, <laughs> did you prepare yourself? Are you good now? No, no, sit down or something. I want to get screenshots. Anna, please. And can you change into like a fancier outfit? Why don't I have MC Command Center installed? <laughs> can you put it down? I'm sorry. I know this is weird, but like, can you can you at least change? You can't just be in a hoodie when you come back to life. Like, put on the formal wear or something. There we go. All right, that's better. That's better. Now you can eat the approach. All right, everyone focus, focus, focus. This is a big moment. Get this clutter out the way. Okay, I want to take some screenshots because again, this is a life-changing experience for us. We've been through a lot together, me and you, and um, now you're gonna return to life. Should I like zoom out? How long does it take? I'm scared to pause or to like, I don't know, cut into the time. I, I want to make sure we catch the whole thing, but um, she's eating quite slow, so. No, that's fine. Take your time. It's been a long time coming for this. Oh my god, wait, she finished it. Wait, 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 wait. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. No, no, wrong way! Don't face that way. I need screenshots! <laughs> Don't face towards the tree. What is wrong with you? Okay, here we go. Here we go. All right, she's out of frame. She's out of frame. That's just great. And poof. <gasps> oh my God, she's back. This, you have no idea how relieved I feel right now. Oh, finally, we have redeemed ourselves after the fire incident. Are you younger than your kid? Okay, no, you're, you're an adult. Oh my God. You're like freshly a young adult. You're like the same age as Blue now. Oh no. Oh, that's actually really bad. I knew that was gonna happen. I was like, at this rate, Pepper's gonna be so much younger than her mom when she comes back to life. But now Anna is like freshly a young adult and Blue is gonna be a young adult in two days. <laughs> oh dear, okay. Well, um, that puts us in an odd position, but you know what? That means Anna's got a lot longer left with us, so maybe I shouldn't complain. Blake, however, died as an elder, so, um, you're gonna have a little bit less time. You're basically gonna come back to life and then die again straight away. They're only elders for a few days on short lifespan, so I feel like I'm kind of wasting an ambrosia with this one, but I don't know, I want to give Blake and Anna a second chance. You know, they deserve it. Anna at least deserves a chance to like live into her old age <laughs> because she did not get that before. If you missed it, um, basically we have this toilet that catches on fire and Anna caught on fire on the- Okay, leave me alone. I'm not going to university. I'm telling a story. And Anna caught on fire with the toilet. But you see, there was like a weird visual glitch where I couldn't see her as being on fire. So she like started the fire, ran outside. I thought she went to work and then I had Blake put the fire out. Everything seemed like it was fine. I thought Anna was gone because she had work just then. Well, Anna wasn't gone. Instead, she was stood in the driveway on fire and then she died of fire. And ever since that day, I have been trying to bring her back to life. Blake, it is now your turn though, so come here. I gotta get some better screenshots this time because one, I think Blake is the more popular of the two, um, but also I didn't get any good ones of Anna, so I need some good ones of Blake for the thumbnail. Blake, you better do this well, okay? Where are you going? What are you doing? Outside? Okay, dinner and a view? This is actually better. Oh, look, and Pepper's gonna sit with you. See, this is a more like lovely moment than before. Oh, no, you stood back up. Where are we going now? What are you doing? Okay, okay, lovely moments. We talked about that. I suppose that makes sense. <laughs> little hug to the person who's uh, bringing you back to life. Now eat the ambrosia. Oh my god. The Sims is at times unbearable. <laughs> Come on. What is wrong? Do I have to reset you or something? Where did it go? Did you? St it's missing. No, I lost it. It's not in your inventory. Why isn't it in their inventory? Hostile chase? What on earth does that mean? Are you being hostile chased by the dog? I don't have time for this. Where did the ambrosia go? No, you don't understand. I could cry right now. It's missing. Tell me I'm not imagining this. The ambrosia plate is missing. It's not in anybody's inventories. It's not on the counter. This one's empty. So I reset Blake and now it's just gone. Like, what? <sighs> Why is this happening to me? Do I have to get some off the gallery? After everything we've been through, this is what the game is doing to me? No, I'm just gonna take this one and I'm gonna place it and we're gonna pretend that I had it all along. 
Okay, I can't I can't do this. <laughs> I can't go through this again. I just can't Blake eat this please just at this point just get it over with I'm done. Okay, you're coming to sit over here. All right start chewing here We go the fact that no one is even sitting with them like, they're going through this life-changing experience alone. <laughs> Everyone just left. Including the ambrosia. The ambrosia also left. They finish. They finish the plate. Wait, 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 wait. Zoom out, zoom out, zoom out. Where are you going? <gasps> okay, I will get better screenshots this time. <laughs> Mark my words. Okay, you can't really see them. What? Your head is in the umbrella! This is so annoying! Why can't I get good screenshots? Why is it physically impossible for me to have good things? How am I supposed to use this for a thumbnail? This has been the most, like, uneventful experience. Like, you'd really think that there would be more to this, and there's just not. Okay, well, welcome back to life, Blake. Um, it's good to see you again. You look great. <laughs> now what? <laughs> like, actually, what do we do now? How long does Blake have left? That's the real question. I mean, maybe, like, six days, which isn't so bad. I mean, it could, it could be worse. Oh, I've got an idea. Should we go do a photo shoot? Do you want to go, like, take some pictures of the two of them together? Like, we can go somewhere pretty, buy, like, some water or something, and then take some photos? No, let's go to, like, the the beach in Tartosa and then have them take some pictures. I like this idea. We need to do something to commemorate this because I forgot about that cherished business. I need to, I just need to not deal with that right now. Anyway, I want to do something to make this moment feel more special. Maybe they could like renew their vows or something. I guess we already did that. But if we planned a wedding, maybe we'd feel better about it. Like maybe just something to make this feel more momentous. All right, here we go. Take a picture of Blake and Anna. Come on. Please actually do it though. I don't have the patience to wait for you to- Oh my god, it's not happening. See, where did Anna go? You're taking the trash out? Really? And you're gonna just stick it on the floor? And then complain about it? Really? That was you. How- how are you gonna complain when that was you? Wait, she's going back? Photographer. Here we go. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go, here we go. Uh, never mind. It canceled itself. Okay. <laughs> Let's try this one more time. Take a picture. No, you don't want to? Okay, take a picture. No, let me reset you. Just one. If I can- I don't think I can get just one. <laughs> Blake left. They put on their swimsuit and went this way. Are you going to like the other beach? Are you serious? Really? To talk to this random guy? Really? Can I even get my stuff- Okay, you know what? I can't put my- I can't get my tripod back. Um, everyone, I'm going home. I'm done. <laughs> I'm just done. I'm going back to the house. I'm gonna hang out with my son. Me and- me and Bo, we're gonna have a good time. Oh, look, Bo's mom is here. There we go. See? This is at least something. This is one positive of today. Let's hang out and talk to Tommy, shall we? There we go. She's bored. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's great. That's just great. I'm really glad that you're here to see me, Tommy, and I'm glad that you think your son is boring. That's excellent news. It's actually really sad, though. Like, it makes me feel really bad for this poor kid. Right now, Blue is also at chess club, which is honestly kind of good. I hope that they're gaining some skills while they're there, although probably not. Oh, and now Blake is suddenly afraid of swimming. You know, fair enough, because we do have a, a deadly pond full of piranhas in the backyard, so that is a reasonable fear. Oh my god, it's so weird to see them both alive live again. It's like really taking me back. I've just seen so many ghosts in this house for so long. It's really weird to have these sims be alive. Look, they still have both the spouse and deceased spouse relationship statuses, which is really funny to me. Oh, a guest coach came to practice today to prepare the team for the upcoming competition. This could be a good opportunity to prank them. They won't even see it coming. Do you think Blue would prank them? I don't know. I don't think Blue is very pranky. I think Blue is kind of a tryhard in school. I feel like I wouldn't prank them, so I don't think they would either. I Thinking of a mischievous plan, Blue realized it would not be nice to prank the guest coach. Better yet, they did not want the rest of the team to get in trouble for it. Today will be another day of boring practice. Decreased relationship status with teammates? Wait, what? I was helping you! <laughs> okay, well, no, whatever. Whatever, that's fine. Whatever. I don't care. I'm not upset. Teens are mean. High school kids are mean. Are you screaming in Blue's face? Oh my god, Blue came home from school and both their grandparents are alive again! Oh, no wonder Blake is screaming in their face! I'd like to think that Blue just didn't know. I know that we've all been, like, planning as a family for this for ages. Like, Blue was actively involved in the, like, catching of the angelfish and stuff. But just the idea of Blue getting home, unaware that today was the day, and all of a sudden returning home and like, oh, you know, grandma's back. <laughs> And she's sitting on the couch, not dead. And also somehow she's like two years older than me. You know what, Blue? Grandma would never ever be mean to you. She wouldn't like dislike you because you didn't prank the guest coach. This is good. You've got a built-in friend. It's kind of like how we never got to know our cousins, but at least now we have grandma and she can be our new bestie. And, and she can keep working her job for so long. <laughs> she's gonna make us so much money. I'm sorry if it seems like I'm less excited about Blake being back to life. It's just that like Blake got to live out so 
long already. So it, it wasn't as traumatic when they died, you know? Like, we love Blake. Blake is one of my favorite sims of all time. But, like, they died of old age. And now they're old again. But Anna, Anna died in a very tragic accident. <laughs> and Anna died, like, really on in her life. Like, she still had young kids and stuff. So <laughs> it's fun that she's back. Oh, dear. Blue has horrible, horrible, horrible needs right now. Do you want to come take care of those? Use the bathroom? Take a bath, maybe? You need to, like, watch some TV or something, too. Oh, my God. The dog's attacking somebody again. Why are you doing that? <laughs> All of a sudden, dog has become very aggressive in her old age. Like, today she was chasing people and she just attacked somebody. You know what else? Blue had a school project. Okay, doesn't fit anywhere. But Blue had a school project. I should probably make them do that. Just for the sake of building some skills. I feel as though that would benefit us. It's a chemical reaction volcano. Okay, we'll gain some logic skill. That's not a bad thing to have. Oh my god, I forgot to make you sleep. I'm so sorry. All of a sudden it's like midnight. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's awake too. I'm so sorry. Go back. Oh, they didn't do their homework either. Oh god. And the toilet is broken. That's all right. I can fix that. That's easy. We have enough money. I don't know why I like make people replace things and repair them. And as soon as Pepper gets home, can you pay the bills? Because I almost forgot to do that too and that would be very bad. Okay, there you go. 5,000 simoleons. Now go to sleep. Today has been a long day. So, I bet you are exhausted. <laughs> this morning you brought both your parents back to life and then you had to work a full shift until like 2 a.m.? That is a lot. That is a very long day. Oh my god. The worst part of having this many sims is that they just keep waking up in the middle of the night. Like, there's never any time of peace. Pepper got home at 3 and now all of a sudden Bo's awake at 4. Like, I just- I can't have time to like sleep through the night and just sit and relax for a second because there's always a sim awake. Are you doing homework in your sibling's room at 5 in the morning? No, if my little brother can came into my bedroom at 5 a.m. and turned all the lights on and started like talking to himself while he studied, I would be furious. <laughs> The fact that Blue is sleeping through this right now. Oh no, they're awake. Yeah, they're awake. And I don't blame them. Okay, well, today is Bo's birthday. So after school, we'll have to throw a party or something. But also, I think I want to go to school today. I think I might go to school with Blue today. Because I want to have like one last ditch effort to make some friends. Because we won't go to school tomorrow since it's Winterfest. So we need to take this like last chance to make some friends in high school. Here we go. Do some more project work too. You've got like an hour before we have to leave. So you can at least try and build some skills also. You're in the chest club and we've gained more logic skill from doing this volcano than from practicing chess. All right, let's join. Oh, look, it's so snowy and beautiful at school today. That's really nice, like the snow in the background. All right, we're on the hunt for teens. Molly, would you like to be friends with me? We're on the chess team together. Molly walked away. Molly, please, I'm so lonely. <laughs> Molly, where did you go? Come back. Okay, okay. Miracle, do you want to be friends with me? Oh, Molly's back. Never mind. Sorry. I'm sorry. Molly's just like, her parents are rich. You know, mom's the principal. I have more to gain from her. I know that sounds bad, but it's true. I think the other day I was saying how I wanted to be enemies with Molly, but at this rate, I'm getting desperate. Like, I'll be friends with anyone. I don't care. And do you know what else? The fact that I can't post about my grandparents coming back to life, that would get me a lot of likes. I'm just saying, I feel as though I should be allowed to post that. To me, it makes no sense. But whatever, it's fine. My other friend Savannah's not even here. So like, we can't try that. Molly is my, my last ditch effort. Wait, Savannah! Oh, there we go. <laughs> Never mind. She was just late. She was just late to school. That's fine. And apparently I'm going to class now, so can't even talk. There we go. Now we're autonomously talking to Savannah. That's what I wanted. I came here for this reason alone. I literally just wanted to make a friend. <laughs> I'm so lonely. It also wants me to study for exams, but I happen to know that I'll be aging up before exams. So I don't have to worry about that. It's not my problem. There is no such thing in this universe, apparently. Oh, I'm gonna pee my pants. Oh no, 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 no. Go to the bathroom, go to the bathroom, go to the bathroom. Run, run, please, fast, quickly. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I'm starting to get nervous. I really don't wanna pee my pants at school. I'm sorry, that's just, that can't happen to us today. There's been enough today already. It's almost as if someone is controlling their life. Will Blue finally fulfill their dreams or will whoever is controlling their life stop their wishes from coming true? Um, <laughs> yikes, <laughs> that's an interesting thought, Blue. Um, I wonder why you're worried about that. I, uh, I can't imagine. What about your life feels controlled? Certainly nothing I did, right? The in-class assignment today was to write some poetry. Easy enough, poetry is just some words. And maybe they are supposed to rhyme? Looking it up on their phone, Blue found some good poetry online as examples, but they're running out of time. Should Blue plagiarize some lesser known poems? 
problems and take the credit. No! No! Don't plagiarize! Okay, we did get a small performance boost. Imagine if we had lost performance from that. Like, oh, you didn't cheat, so you failed. No, 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 no. Blue is a good person. They are very successful in their own right. And I'd like to hang out with some friends today, but I feel as though maybe we shouldn't because today is also our little brother's birthday. So I might just run home and hang out at home a little bit tonight and like have some sort of family party. You know what? Your grandparents coming back to life is a pretty good birthday gift. I'm not gonna lie. Day before Christmas in game as well. That's not, not a bad present. See, meanwhile, Blue is like terrified of somebody controlling their life, but I am a good person. I am very kind to this family. I worked really hard to help you. And it's not my fault the bad things happen most of the time. So, ooh, Tommy's calling, wait. Ooh. <laughs> Hey honey, it's mom. When are you going to come visit? I put all my love and effort into raising you. You can at least drop by once in a while and tell your dear mommy you love her, can't you? Okay, first of all, this is the first time this call has actually made sense because a lot of times my sims get this call and they like live with their parents, but um, we actually haven't seen Tommy in a while. Although yesterday when you were here, you were very mean to my brother. You were saying you were bored of talking to him. So you can come over right now. I mean, it's Beau's birthday and we'll have a little party, a little family of, are you falling over? Oh no. Okay, sorry. I thought she was about to fall, but she was just doing sit-ups. Kind of the opposite. All right, well, you know what? I feel- Oh, you're missing! Oh no, I forgot! Oops, you've got chess club. Yeah, that's my bad. Sorry, Blue. It's your last day of club, too. Oh, I feel bad. That's kind of sad. Anyway, when Blue gets back from the club, we'll probably throw a birthday party for Bo. I think I'll, like, plan a little event, invite the cousins and stuff. But I feel as though I should probably end this part right here. I mean, it's not as though we've had an uneventful day. We did, in fact, bring two Sims back to life and I only cheated for one of them. The other one I did fair and square. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. I love this family. I love the Bell family. I have so much fun with these Sims. If you want to go back and catch up, I'll link that playlist down below if you want to watch the whole series. And remember, stay tuned because we're kind of about to start a new generation. We're sort of like in the midst of it with Blue being a teen, but Blue's going to age up into a young adult soon, like probably in the next episode as well. And so when Blue becomes a young adult, that's usually when we make a new house and like start over. Wait a minute. Is that? Oh, it's empty. Wait. <gasps> it's the missing Ambrosia! We got it back! Oh my god, we need to save that. No, like seriously, we need to save that and, and make sure we don't lose it because that is really good to have. Why did that just randomly appear in the sky? Why was it floating? How, like, that was not there earlier. Anyway, it's almost Blue's time to shine, so I'll have to start thinking about, like, what their house is gonna look like, who they'll end up marrying, stuff like that pretty soon. I'm gonna miss this house, but it's always fun to, like, have new eras, you know? So on that note, I will stop ranting at you. Thank you again for watching, and I'll catch you all tomorrow, okay? Bye, everybody. Oh my god, and Dog is gonna die? I don't even want to think about that. Because I feel like I have to worry about Blake enough already now that Blake's an elder again. But, like, I don't want to deal with Dog dying too.